hello guys and welcome to a brand new video today i'm here with a new video this will be me reacting to the trailer of honkai star rail a new trailer has been released a few uh few minutes ago and i just saw it and i saw like the youtube channel as well like i did not know that there was a youtube channel for honkai star rail i like you know i found it out today and uh, yeah so it's out uh it's called next stop the stars and i'm guessing we're going to get more information about the game and i'm pretty excited because anything related to honkai i am very much like you know enthusiastic about that because i just love honkai so much so let's check it out let's see what this is about and i think the beta testing has also been uh, uh, not been started but it the application has been like you know like uh, given out and people are signing up for it currently so yeah it will probably take a few months probably in 2022 in the beginning like you know few months we're probably going to get the actual game i, th I think so at least it's probably be something it will probably be something like that but for now let's react to the trailers i'm really excited to see what this is about so so yeah without further ado let's get started and i'll be linking down the original video in the description box if you've not checked it out you can go to the description box and check it out so yeah so anyways let's get started with this video first i'm going to react to it first and i'm going to give my impressions so here we go reveal trailer next stop the stars start all right Delaron. Oh, this girl. We saw her in the Reborn 2 trailer. Many millennia have passed. Is this what your Relo 6 has become? Your Relo 6. Wow, this. This is beautiful. What is. Well then, are you ready for your first trailblazing expedition since joining the crew? Trailblazing. Oh, these are the characters? This guy looks like Zhongli. <laughs> oh, she's a bow user. That girl. Oh my god. Wow. Oh, this is like an open world? Oh. If we have treasure chests and stuff. That looks like Bronya. What? <laughs> what? Damn, Ganyu! <laughs> wow, this... Okay, this really looks good. Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Oh boy, well... Honkai Star Rail. Humans never conceal their desire to control the heavens. Is that Himeko? So why would I? Is that Himeko? I think so. May this journey lead us starward. Okay. Well, you know, this looks amazing. Okay, one thing. Um, I think I've heard this from other people. Uh. This is a, a turn-based RPG, isn't it? So first of all, uh, I like you know I usually do not like turn-based like the stuff that much because uh, you know because it needs strategizing. <laughs> I just like to like you know go in <laughs> without any plans, kind of like that. But you know like I've I've played my share uh, you know fair share of turn-based RPGs, you know JRPGs. Uh, I've played a, quite a few of them and uh, for because this is honkai you know like yeah i'm definitely like going to play this obviously because just because this is honkai and if this was some other game you know which was like just turn-based rpg i would probably just skip it because i usually don't go for turn-based rpg but yeah this is honkai so no questions asked i'll definitely going to i'm definitely going to play this and okay so from the trailer we can see uh, one thing that there are a few characters, a uh, few characters we are already uh, acquainted with. Uh, the, the first character that we are already acquainted with is Welt. Um, then uh, we saw that girl, I think, who we also saw in the Reborn 2 trailer. You know, that girl who, um, during the uh, you know, flashback of Carol. 
and uh, that girl so i'm guessing okay so reborn true is actually a trailer for Hokai star rail i i thought when i was reacting to it i thought it was a like you know some kind of an animation for apple but now like you know now i can see it like welt is there that girl is also there so i'm guess they did not show carol here so i'm guessing they're also going to introduce carol in this maybe in the future so i'm not sure okay so first of all mm, let's check out the characters here um okay this girl obviously we know her uh from i think this is the same girl who we saw in reborn 2 and she will be here in this game okay then okay this is himeko at first i wasn't able to recognize her i think so this is himeko but the last thing kind of made it obvious i guess um yeah this is probably himeko and uh, what else okay the sceneries and all these stuff are beautiful just look at this now if this is uh this is a uh, open world turn-based rpg i think and this being open world it will be something like genshin i'm guessing but with turn basic like, for example just like uh, how you did it for persona and stuff like you know you used to like walk around and then suddenly when the, the monsters like there were random monsters spawn in the open world and you like you know when you go close to them they, they like an at attack sequence starts where there's like turn based like you know you need to click on the uh, different attacks attack defend or you know use items that that thing i'm guessing it will be something like that most probably i'm not sure uh, like yeah that's the only way they can probably do this so it'll be something like that you know just like 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 all the other different jrpgs that we have played you know for example uh, i think dragon quest and then uh, what else the tales series and the tales series is an action rpg was there is I don't remember, but you know, the Tales series I'm talking about. Um, yeah, okay, so it'll be something like that, I'm guessing. Now, okay, first of all, okay, the characters. This guy, this guy is here, um, this is another person. Okay, these three, okay, <laughs> he looks completely like Zhongli, like you know like just look at him so and this this person as well now okay we can see this is like a huge some kind of an, i'm guessing this will be some kind of post apocalyptic i don't think so i'm not sure it looks like it is it's based on space and at the same time we can see these type of sceneries I, i'm guessing is this will this be like something you're like going from one planet to another we'll see all right yeah he really looks like zhongli even with the you know the spear you know and i think his clothes kind of remind me of fuka's azure imperia uh, you know dress kind of the color scheme is kind of the, like that yeah yeah this this color scheme you know like it, it looks like uh, fuka's azure imperia's dress the original dress okay now okay now as here we can see i'm guessing the small little game mechanics like for example like we can see this person running and then there's this monsters kind of patrolling as i said it'll be something like that you know like if you i'm guessing if you attack the monsters from behind you'll get an advantage but if the monster attacks you from behind you, you'll get, get it a disadvantage that's like you know in other games in other uh, jrpgs open world jrpgs they have this kind of an uh, mechanic maybe they'll put that in here as well maybe not who knows but yeah okay now we can see a few other monsters as well now here's the thing this girl uses a bow and she she's like ganyu like you know like like ice <laughs> ice crystals uh, falling from the sky and uh, what else like this this is like a weird mixture of honkai and genshin for example this this scene this scene completely reminds me of uh, the first scene in Genshin where we go meet the new characters, you know, like Lisa is there in, in, in that room. If I, I can't remember the... Yeah, it was in Mondstadt, the, the, the room where you get in the beginning, you know, where you, I think there's, that's the place where your wish gets unlocked. You know, you meet Lisa, Jan in that room. This room looks like that. And, you know, like, it's like a mixture as and all the different characters as well. As I said, that girl kind of shoots both, like, you know, the, the attacks are like Ganyu 
and all that stuff so it's like a mixture you can see small little stuff from both games and okay this girl another thing from kind of like genshin i'm guessing yeah this girl <laughs> looks like those uh you know uh, like clee uh, not clee this kind of looks like sayu in a way yeah okay this is this person as well i'm not sure who this girl is but yeah and these are like yeah this is like floating uh like i'm guessing mechanics okay and just like genshin we'll have treasure chests and all okay so what else okay um uh, this girl here looks like a weird mixture of bronya and uh, duranda you know her dress especially like her, her her hair reminds me of bronya but the way she's standing with that blue and white dress is fully duranda <laughs> okay and this is another person here as well yeah what else Okay, we can see this girl with her bow. <laughs> All right. Okay, this guy uses what is this? Uh, uh some kind of a pole arm or something? I think. Okay, and yeah, this this is like the fighting sections. Okay, and so I'm guessing Welt will be playable here. Welt, <laughs> cool, with the you know <laughs> the glasses thing that all anime characters do. <laughs> all anime characters with the glasses too. Okay, now the last scene here. I think this is Himeko. I think so. I'm not sure. Like, okay, her face is fully Himeko. I think. I'm not sure about the character. I might be wrong though. This might not be Himeko. I'm not sure. No, because <laughs> because we're kind of accustomed with Himeko, like you know, getting drunk. <laughs> so like that's that's what's probably kind of like making me think that this probably is not Himeko. We can see this girl here, very elegantly sitting, sipping tea. So that that definitely is is not <laughs> like himeko but her face really reminds me of himeko and oh uh, and obviously her hair so i'm not sure this might be a different character but who knows i love her character design like you know the the sleeveless dress with the the thing the little cape is that a cape isn't it yeah the late little cape thing in her back and her hairstyle is really nice as well so Probably she'll be a character. I'm not sure if she'll be a free character or a gacha character, you know. Um, either way, I'm definitely getting her when she comes. So, <laughs> yeah, I'm already making plans even when the game has not started. So, <laughs> yeah. All right. So that was it. So this was the trailer, the reveal trailer of um, Honkai Star Rail. Now, I'm pretty excited. So let's see how this goes. And... As I said, like, you know, I'm, I'm really a big fan of Honkai, so getting to see something related to Honkai and getting a new game in itself is such a big, like, you know, great thing. So I'm really excited. I'm, I'm definitely going to check this out when it comes out. And yeah, well, like, I'll, I'll probably make some gameplay videos as well. I'll definitely make some gameplay videos, but that's for the next year, I'm guessing, when this will be released. So yeah, so we have to wait a little bit, but yeah, we're kind of used to it, I guess. <laughs> like you know gacha players and all that so yeah that's it thank you guys for watching if you guys are uh, if you guys uh, enjoyed this video be sure to press the like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel all you have is subscribed i kind of put out um, occasional Gon genshin um, um honkai and i also do fgo videos as well like you know and normal anime reactions you can check them out if you want to and uh, yeah so that's it so uh, oh and um, uh, comment down below anything you want to say anything you want to let me know at uh, your uh you know if you're excited for this or what whatever you know like just let me know in the comment section and yeah i'll definitely check them out so that's it guys so thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video so until then goodbye and have a nice day